Let's see if I can pull it. Let's see if I can do this with uh, number four. Aren't we going to do number five? We're going to do number five first, but let me okay. do. Um, oh, while you're talking. You're while to I'm four. talking, I got to think <laughs> of the movie. Um, uh, oh, I. I know I have it. There it is. Okay. All right. Number okay. five. The number five top romantic movie to watch on Valentine's Day if you're single. single. Notting Hill starring Hugh Grant and um, Julia, Roberts. Julia Roberts, where she is a famous actress mm -hmm. filming in London. Mm -hmm. He's a bumbling British uh, 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 civilian mm -hmm. who comes in contact Don't with this famous actress, and it's the bumbling romance. Here's a theme song. You can there you go. <laughs> yeah. Who sings this? Is this the guy who sang You're Beautiful? <laughs> Who sings this song? When you say nothing by Ronan Keating. Oh, now we must know that you picked this one. I love this song. The smile on your face. What are you talking about? You say it best. You say it best when you say nothing at all. When you say nothing. That's your choice. I like uh, Notting Hill. <laughs> number five. Number four. Mm -hmm. Number four brought us this iconic scene with. Uh, John Cusack uh, holding up the boombox. Bring me up here, bad boy. <laughs> this is one of the most iconic. Now he'd be holding this. <laughs> <laughs> he'd, be, he'd be holding his iPhone up. <laughs> that would come up with better sound. Mm, this is my jam. Right? Mm. Of course, the movie, Say Anything. Say Anything. Where Lloyd Dobler, you really would date Lloyd Dobler? Yeah, totally. Yeah, I would too. He's a great guy. Is that Ioni Sky? Yes, Ioni uh -huh. Sky. Lloyd Dobler, who uh, goes up to the father and says, when the, when the father says, Lloyd, what do you want to do with your life? Well, I don't want to buy anything sold or processed or sell anything bought or processed or process anything sold or bought. Basically, I just want to spend as much time as I can with your daughter. <laughs> but you've only seen the movie once or twice. My goodness, how do you remember those that's a lines? Great, that's a great movie. It was good. All right, mm -hmm. that's number four. Number three, which, again, the editors of the Fab, the KTRS Fab Fab Five poll argued over this. Do you want a romantic comedy like Say Anything where they end up happily ever after or Notting Hill they end up happily ever after? Mm -hmm. Or a heart-wrenching, pull your heart out, Don't give it six one. handkerchief watch of La La Land <laughs> is our number three. Mother girl this movie, this, sky, this movie rips your heart out. Well, I wouldn't. You're so dramatic. No, this movie really upset me. <laughs> because, because it was all, and then at the end, it wasn't so. Because da, 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 da. it's billed as a, as a nice, you know, musical song and dance. It is a nice musical song and dance until it rips your heart out in the end. I have. Here's the other thing that I can't talk about it because I don't want to ruin it. For, for well, you basically did. No, I haven't ruined anything. So La La Land number three. So to recap, Notting Hill five, Say Anything four, La La Land three. Number two, The Notebook. Oh, hell, well, if you're going to do it, why wait until the summer ends, huh? Why don't you just do it right now? Huh? Come on. Come on. Do it. Do it. And the reason why number two, The Notebook, you know why. The fact that Ryan Gosling is in two of these. Oh, I never did watch The Notebook. You've never seen The Notebook? OMG. You have no. never seen The Notebook? Shame did on I you. Stutter? Your girl card is taken <laughs> away. No, I, it's hard for me to watch truly heart wrenching. I can't watch that. Well, you have to watch because Ryan Gosling's a woodworker. Oh, no. <laughs> you and your ulterior motives for some of these. No, 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 no. That's a legit number two. That is a oh. legit number two. And the number one romantic movie single people should watch on Valentine's Day is... But it doesn't take much to see that the problems of three little people don't amount to a hill of beans in this crazy world. Someday you'll understand that. Ah, no. He's looking at you, kid. 
Ingrid Bergman, Humphrey Bogart. You must remember that. Casablanca. Can we please do the honorable mention? My we, movie. We, we, will do the, we will do the honorable mention, but Casablanca, by the way, yeah. on, on the poll, oh, the overwhelming yes. number one favorite was Casablanca. by the audience. Uh, is it Casablanca. Casablanca or Casablanca? Casablanca. Um, there is gambling going on in this establishment. <laughs> I am shocked. Um, all right, here are the um, honorable mentions. Harry Met Sally. When Harry Met Sally. When Harry Met Ruth, which is the story of my life, which did not end as, <laughs> which did not end as well as Harry Met Sally. I'll have what she's having. <laughs> this is my all-time favorite The reason why comedy. it didn't make the list is because it's a New Year's Eve Christmas okay, movie. Okay, first of all... It was set around Christmas and New Year's. I but know, but they show new, they show a, it all the time around New Year's. Oh my gosh! Malamar's world's greatest cookie. Seriously, and I'm about to give the Knicks their it first championship since 1973. Freaking calm. Yes, I love this. <laughs> Hi, uh, you haven't called me. If uh, you haven't called me because you <laughs> you haven't gotten these messages, you don't want to call me, or you're trapped under something heavy. If it's either one or three, please call me back. <laughs> yes. Uh, so Harry Met Sally, uh -huh. Affair to Remember uh, with Cary Grant and Deborah yes. Kerr, where they meet on, on top of the uh, Valentine's where Day. they meet on top of the uh, Empire, Empire State, State Building, Building. and uh, a, a dark horse. Which, if you've seen all of these and you want to see one you haven't seen, it's an old timer. It's black and white. It is a ten handkerchief movie, Penny Serenade. Not what I've never heard of. Car it. Cary Grant, a young Cary Grant, and his wife can't have children. So they decide to have a they, they decide to adopt a child. It's called Penny Serenade, and it I can't even talk about it now. I'm breaking up over Aww. it. It's a great movie. Yeah. So honorable mentions: Harry Met Sally, A Fair to Remember, and Penny Serenade. Mm, Those nice. are the movies you should watch as single on Valentine's Day. That is the Fab Five poll here on the Big Five Fifty KTRS. Jealousy and hate, woman needs man.